Penn State Berks Ice Hockey is a Division I ACHA program that plays in the Eastern Collegiate Hockey Association. We are going to follow them this week as they are preparing for their divisional matchup with the Towson Tigers. Mondays have turned into routine for most of the players. Either they have class before or they get to sleep in until it's time to head to the rink. Most of the players stay in apartments nearby the rink and others stay in dorms on campus. Normally, the captains are the first ones at the rink in order to open up the locker room and make sure everything is ready to go smoothly for practice. So I'm sitting here with Eric DeLellis and Kenny Keene. They're both sophomores here on the Penn State Berks Ice Hockey team. We kind of just want to talk, talk to you um, today about what we kind of do in preparation leading up to a big game, um, what we do during the week, how practice are really run, um, and, and behind scenes kind of stuff to show you that it's it's more than just a game. Um, so I just kind of want to discuss on Monday um, what typically happens out of practice. Um, de depending on how we played the uh, previous weekend is um, how the practice really ends up. Um, it can either be really, really rough and challenging or it can be um, a fun and energetic practice. Um, Typically, a Monday practice is you're getting back in the swing of things. You're you're looking to get the hands ready. You're you're looking to um, get the feet going. It's it's usually high pace, high tempo, um, battle drills, one on ones, things like that. Um, it's it's pretty much fun most of the time. Again, depending on how we play during the weekend. Um, if we have a bad weekend, it then turns into a hard skate, what we usually call a bag skate, where we're we just skate the whole time, um, kind of as a punishment for not playing to our full potential. Um, again, but typically practices usually like this Monday practice was pretty pretty energetic, pretty high tempo. We got everyone going, um, and typically at the end of practice, what we do is we have um, some fun time. Um, our coach usually lets us uh, have some fun with the guys, uh, a little competitive fun. This particular Monday, the players' competitive sides were tested during a game called Activator between the rookies and the vets. This game determines which group stays on the ice late to pick up pucks and empty water bottles. The rookies have yet to be victorious. Yeah. All right, so I'm going to pass it on to Eric Delos here. He's going to kind of talk about um, Wednesday practices and how they differ from Monday. Um, typically going into Wednesday practices, we evaluate what we did the previous weekend, um, what mistakes we made, what we need to do right, and what we need to change in order to be successful the, for the upcoming weekend. So Eric, just run us through what's going on on Wednesday practices, what's the, what the flow like, what's, what's the energy like, um, and what kind of drills you do. Uh, so usually on Wednesday, we work on power like system stuff, such as power play and penalty kill, and find the little things that didn't work over the weekend and fix them. And it's upbeat, big, like high tempo, trying to get the boys ready for the weekend and for the scratches and stuff. It's taught, like they, for them to prove themselves if they're going to play this weekend or not, that kind of thing. No player has an automatic spot in the lineup each week. You need to show you have what it takes and earn your spot in the lineup. This all starts at practice. Although hockey is played on a sheet of ice, every player needs to dedicate time and effort off the ice to improve their game. Most of the guys hit the gym three to four times a week in order to stay strong and healthy. Injuries are inevitable in such an aggressive sport such as hockey, but keeping in shape and strengthening muscles can help prevent these injuries and keep players in the lineup. All right, so now, um... Kenny Keene here is going to talk to us about um, what we have on Thursday. Thursday we have um, some ice put aside for the for the Penn State Berks ice hockey team, um, and he's going to go in a little bit more detail about that and what guys um, are able to do when they come out and um, work on their stuff. So uh, on Thursday we try and get a couple of the guys out as many as we can. Really, we we like to have. We, sometimes we work on things or we'll play little games. Uh, guys will take a section of the ice and work on their hands or work on skating, maybe with the coach. And on the other end, a lot of the guys like to play little mini games and just, just keep the legs loose and keep everything up to shape. So By the end of the day Thursday, the team leaves the ice with everyone on the same page. Every man knows their role 
and how they will contribute to the team. Special teams and systems are memorized and ready to be applied. Coaches have developed a game plan and the boys start to get mentally prepared for the weekend. What are, uh, what are some things you got to do to get prepared for a game? Uh, just got to, you know, get focused mentally and uh, get some liquids in me, get ready to play. <laughs> yeah, that's about it. <laughs> so what would you do to get prepared for the game today? Uh, I ate a couple bananas. Did you, banana, uh, banana, I'm a big banana guy. Pick any good movies. I did. I'm, I'm, I don't know why. I brought Mr. Deeds every time. No one wants to watch it. Yeah, all right. <laughs> all right, Bedwell, what'd you do to get uh, prepared for the game today? So, uh, took a nice nap earlier, watched some game film, studied their plays, you know, went down. I watched some practice last week, actually, so we am pretty good. I'm ready for this. All right, Dalton, what'd you do this morning to get prepared for the roadie? Uh, you know, I woke up real early, got some nice breakfast in got mentally prepared. That's about it. Love it. It's not all about eating breakfast and getting mentally prepared. There are things that need to be taken care of before the team hits the road, such as making sure everyone's skates are sharpened and ready to go for the game ahead. Finally, the last bag is loaded onto the bus, and the boys are off to Maryland to face their division rival, Towson. Bus rides are mostly relaxed while the team plays Xbox and watches movies. Upon arrival, the team begins to focus on nothing but the task at hand and bring home three points in what can be a crucial game to the future of their season. Right, like I said, you guys are running, you guys are running the only 2-1-2 two -two shift of the night to start. A 28 on D, 27 on D, 22, 21, 97, one, you're in net. At the end of the day, the hard work and dedication paid off, and Burks walked away with three points. But it's a long season, and it all starts again early morning Monday at practice. Mm -hmm.